Here is Ward. Straight away a three for Tom Ward. First points <laughs> of the game for the Thunder. Well, we know the energy that uh, Walsh plays with. It's going to be interesting to see how he has dovetailed into the Loughborough team. <laughs> and there's a three from Zaire Taylor. First points on the board. Abdul driving inside, goes Ooh. in and puts it in and foul. Hafiz Abdul really showing some premise early on. A three on the way is good for Milo Gordon. With Charnwood, Loughborough and Leicester opting not to go to the States and instead continuing his career here in the UK. That's a great sign for British basket. Frantic pace to this game as uh, Walsh had yep. it stripped away from Taylor and Jared Dixon with the breakaway dunk. And the Thunder have raced away to a 21-7 lead. Cross-court pass to Wild. Nice pass inside, but great defense <laughs> from Zaire Taylor. <laughs> We've seen that a few times. So quick. Dixon. Dixon finds a way to score. Final Oof. 20 seconds of this first period. Here is Ward to an open Hafiz Abdul. Yes, we talked about that earlier, didn't Absolutely, we? Absolutely, yeah. Know. And like you said, they're missing Harrison Gamble and a couple of maybe older heads. Yeah. As oh, there we go. Straight away, Dwayne Areja with a long two. Abdul from the corner. Abdul, Ooh. that's good. You compare that with just two for the Thunder. There's Dixon. Abdul again, tries oh, it again my. and puts it in again. If it's not broke, don't fix it, right? Absolutely, Hafiz Abdul with back-to-back -back threes. He moves on to 14. All those Milton Keynes summer camps he went to, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> the water's different. Oh, he's oh, lost but it. Dixon steals it off Evan Walsh and another dunk for Jared Dixon on the turn of breakaway. Oh, oh. And an offensive foul. Wow. Great defense, great court awareness there from Nicholas Ballon. Fantastic. He saw that opportunity and planted his feet. Waiting right there for the charge. Terrific. Absolutely. Terrific. And here is Taylor. The up and under. An open man is Hafiz Abdul for three. 46-21 in favour of the Thunder. Here is Fakail. The extra pass. Evan Walsh is wide open for three and he strings it. Evan Walsh a 43% three-point shooter. And it's 47-27 in favour of the Thunder. Uh, again, you know, whenever they move the ball one way to the other and back again, they get the opportunities. Nice pass oh, inside pass. and Abdul with the finish. Great find from Tom Ward. Howard, he's going to pass it up. Dixon I just think. about collects, puts up a three and knocks it down. Jared Dixon with the corner three. Let's tweak that ankle. It's been in the wars tonight, hasn't he? As uh, Evan Walsh is a three is good from Milo Gordon. That's and on brilliant. the far, there you go, a steal from the inbounds. And score. And Joe Bilek says thank you very much. And Run. Evan Walsh collects the loose ball again. Yeah, going all the way by. That ankle seems to be doing him good as Gordon puts up a corner three yeah. and hits. Great spell this from the Riders. And Julian Stanley was going to call a timeout. I think he did, but they didn't hear him. Yeah, they time. didn't hear him. Yeah, called it too late. An open Headley. Nice. Guy. And inside, oh, yeah. and the dunk there from Conroy Hayden. All right. We had a great offensive uh, rebound from Milo just before, and then we got a nice throw down. Turns it over. Yeah, turns it over to Walsh. Walsh going inside. Ah. It was two on four. Evan Walsh wanted a foul. He's got to keep playing. Can't Absolutely. Be about that. Open Jared Dixon for two as Evan Walsh continued to remonstrate with the officials. As opposed to a turnover and run out. Headley. Going too quickly, going too quickly. Good okay. defense from Sunderland. Morel for three, gets it to go. Chester Morel from downtown. Ward, Sunderland. Thought about the three and said drives inside. And open Ishmael Fontaine for three, and that's money. Oh, well, uh, there's the kids going up and down, yelling and screaming. <laughs> Final seconds of this third period. Here is Crawford. Crawford backing his man down, kicks it out to Ishmael Fontaine. Such a smooth Ooh. release, and Ishmael Fontaine drains his second three of the night. Thunder now with 15, or 16, excuse me, offensive rebounds. 
Morrell for three, and that's money for Chester Morrell. Well, he's shown that he can knock that down easy. Wild finds a bit of room from the perimeter and scores. Final five minutes and 19 seconds as Taylor on the spin. Kicks it out to an open Kai Nicholas in the corner for two. <laughs> there you go. Kai Nicholas off the mark. As Bylock puts up a three Ooh. and that's good. One of the Loughborough guys take their time and have some patience. They can get some good looks and good execution. They just gotta not get caught up in the helter skelter. Taylor for three, splash. Yeah, this reminds everybody. Eight points. Credit to everybody here. Absolutely. Ward. Jack Sunderland in the corner from his favorite Hooray! spot for two. Right out of the timeout into another three. And Jack Sunderland, the product of Amring, getting the two. Morell. Step back three Ooh! for Chester Morell. It's turned into a shootout, John. We've had four back to back <laughs> threes. Ward. Fontaine driving at Gordon. Fontaine off the glass. A little bit of everything now we're seeing. Uh oh. Justin Headley stripped by Sunderland. Oh, Zion. And Taylor the on the fast break. Oof. Lays it up and in. I thought. <laughs> I just thought. <laughs> you thought for a moment he was going to take the elevator to the seventh floor. Oh. <laughs> I thought he was going to turn back the clock. <laughs> but instead opted for the easy finish. I think that was probably safer for all of us. <laughs> <laughs> there there it, is. it is on the replay. <laughs> yep, soft off the glass. <laughs> it gets the kind roll. And oh, for uh, the final time tonight, and it's only fair that we both stand up and applaud Zaire Taylor. Awesome, the way they sent Absolutely. him there. Dixon. And no good with his two. Zaya Taylor, 10 points, six steals in his final home game, regular season home game yep. for the Thunder. Of course, there is a possibility that Thunder could have home court advantage in the playoffs. Here is Ward. Well, that would count for something, that's for sure. Uh -oh. Fontaine oh! takes the elevator, <laughs> but misses the dunk. Yep, and I think we should dribble it out Absolutely. now. Give everybody their applause. On what you could say on Zaire Appreciation Night, his final regular season home game, 10 points on four for nine shooting, four rebounds, three assists, six steals. But most importantly, Worthing Thunder get the win here in their final home game of the season. A 91-75 win over the Loughborough Riders who dropped to 8 and 17 for the season. Yeah, a terrific evening. I mean, played in the right way. It did get a little chippy, like you said, in the third, but only because both teams were very, very competitive. Great to see the effort that the home team put out into this showing, but also Loughborough played their part. You know, there was, there was rumours of the arrival of this uh, great BBL player uh, who was going to come in. And so I came on the scene the following season. And I think it is fair to say that people would agree on the team that there is no man in the world like Zaya Taylor. He is the, the most unique uh, basketball player. Uh, I would think, obviously, you guys have seen him play basketball. Um, from a teammate's perspective, he is. Probably the most incredible basketball player that, that I've, I've played with. Um, his instincts for the game, uh, I've never seen anything like him, very well on defense and on offense. Uh, he's, he's an incredible basketball player, but we're very grateful, obviously, to have had him here and have him part of the way we've kind of set up. But getting to know Trey right here, you know, I, I immediately saw this kind of flamboyant character who was, again, a unique individual with some unique habits and, and tendencies. But what, what really sets what really sets I uh, apart is things like this. What really sets I apart from other players is he is the people's champion.
champion. He is the guy who comes here and, and spends time in the community. He makes sure he likes every kid in the crowds. He, he talks to people and he likes to learn about people and, and, and he's interested by people's stories, despite having one of the most interesting stories in the world. So, um, you know, I guess on, on behalf of, of the Word and Thunder organisation, everyone who's played alongside him, who's played against him, um, we are so, so lucky to have a man like Zion Taylor here in the Thunderdome. Um, and let's, let's give him a huge round of applause.